23 days for the first thousand points going to touch. 10 years, 6 months, 23 days it took. But the last 7,000 points took just 6 and a half months. How oh, and why? Participation. In 1994-96, I'm sure people who are of that era, what was the rate of FD, you know? Fixed deposit rate, it was 17%. Risk free return in 95-96 was 17%. Why will I risk that? Why? If, if a risk free return is 17%, why will I go to invest in stock market? Why will I go put money in gold? That's why nobody had heard of gold 15 years ago. Or it means it was their gold as an argument, that's all. Because a risk free opportunity was giving me something. What was inflation then? It was a person who cared about inflation then? No, no, inflation was not a talk the gold gold at all 15 years ago. Because I remember when I was going to work for a company called Apple Credit Club over four and a half years in NBFC between 1996 and uh, 2000. Then, morning 9 15, my office used to open. We used to sell FDs. In one year, we got 600 crores FD. People used to stand in queue. It used to come Nalli Singh and go to hotel OBC. Now, the those are global transfer companies OBC. Second, the people used to stand in the, the staircase to invest in FD. 70%. People are happy getting this for 70%. Now, cut to 2010. The FD return of 6.75% in 2010, July. Inflation was 12.48%. Solution. People like us, I'm 47 years, I'll be 47 years. Maybe you are 50, 60 years of people like you and probably a little bit of mine are. We are extremely proud and happy that we didn't live in an era where there was a fair confidence. Because today, a lot of things can happen like pop up. I didn't live in the era. I was happy drinking a 2 rupee coffee on the roadside. I was happy to see movie in Kendagora Road, Menaka Theatre, Movie Land Theatre, uh, States Theatre, Saga Theatre, Alanka, all the girls in all the theatres. We were happy seeing pay 2 rupees, 5 rupees, watch a movie, go in a BTS bus, bring superb pollution, nothing has happened to me. Amazing pollution attacks. Okay, even I didn't uh, survive in uh, out of distillery water. I didn't see movies in multiplex. We are happy today. How many of you are watching HMT watching? What is HMT? You ask yourself. Today the world has moved towards becoming a brand oriented for everything. At 17 percent FD, 7 percent inflation. I was and no other uh, ex uh, entertainment for me. I was happy for entertainment for me. But today, it has just reversed. Inflation is double digit. Every <coughs> return is single digit. I am not making real return at all. I want to overcome this particular problem. Now, the question I am going to put before you is how? You said you don't want your 100 rupees to become 99, you don't want your money to become 75, you don't want your money to become 50, you don't want to become 25, or forget about to become money becoming zero. But how will you overcome this problem? You give me a solution. Top markets are bad. Everything. My first quote is top markets are worst. Speculators, then gamblers, gambling in the place. Now tell me, what is the solution? What should you do? What should I do? How will you overcome this problem? If stock markets are bad, if risk taking is not a cup of tea, if you are not willing to make 100 rupees becoming 50 rupees, because the rule in the market is 1 is to 4. What is 1 is to 4? For every 4 rupees you are wanting to make, be ready to lose 1 rupee. Is it fair or not fair? Without this, do not come to the market. If you do 
not want to lose money in the market, please don't come. Please don't come to the market. This is not for you. If you are not willing to die, why not all you have a all? Why not all? Every day, hundreds of babies get born. Parents willing only that one day this child will die. That's what Mankutima, DVG said in his Mankutima Nakaga. What did it say? Kottilu Pugutti hai Masana Tegudhiru. Means in a house when a cradle is shaking, the funeral ground is laughing. <laughs> this guy will come one day. Nothing to worry about. So what am I scared of? When I'm buying a stock, I should buy like that's why Warren Buffett is called one of the biggest investor uh, guru, you know, investing guru. No? He said you buy a stock thinking the stock market is going to be closed for next 10 years. Simple thing, yeah. forget about anything else. Forget about all these other methodology, uh, uh, whatever we can talk. You buy a stock thinking that this particular company is going to close tomorrow, or stock market is going to close tomorrow. Do I have the pets? People take certain computers, certain computers. Take one bad example. I can put thousand good examples. One bad example cannot one by one side for doesn't I'm going to walk again. 4043 companies are listed on BSC. 1,000 are listed on LSC. Now pick your thoughts. How will you pick? Where will you pick from? How will you make a beginning? I am looking at only the stock. No, please don't look at the stock. Look at first the indices. Where are I picking the stock from? I am picking the stock from BSC Sensex or from BSC 100, BSC 200, BSC 500, BSC Metal. Why are these indices made, you know? Entire 4,000 companies are being made part of one of the other indices that's all. Either the stock in small cap index, mid cap index, 100, BSC 200, BSC 300, anything. It's somewhere up there. You need to differ from where you are picking. Let's say you want to pick from BSC 100. From BSC 100, now how many sectors are there in the stock market? There are 33 defined sectors in the stock market. From starting from A, automobile aviation, till uh, paper products, all those things. 33 defined, clearly defined sectors are there. How many sectors are you going to invest in? You put money in all the different sectors? No. Now, let me take a simple questions, uh, answers only. Which sector do you think are going to well in the next five years? Let me the sectors. <coughs> okay, I'll go alphabetically. Okay, I'll go to automobile. Next. Banking, very good. The French FMCG, consumer durable? Education, sir. I'm sorry, sir? Education. Education, yeah, I got Educom. I'm reading. Yeah. Ah, pharma. Yeah. IT. IT, very good. Insurance. Insurance. Infrastructure, very good. Telecom. Retail. Retail. Power. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, out of 33, you have to one third, 11 sectors. Okay, now out of these 11, what is the priority sectors? FNC. Priority, that means you are going to give first preference to it. Very good. I am going by my understanding. Banking. Sorry? FNC. Farmers will become very good. FMC is obviously you know. Consumer about spending. Infrastructure. Oh, yeah. Maybe yeah. 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 retail, you look at infra, or maybe you look at auto, some maybe you look at we'll look at eight sectors. Sounds good? Out of 33 sectors, defined sectors in the stock market, I am picking eight sectors. <coughs> yes, even the office I want to put everything. That's why it puts out there. I like all the fruits. Instead of buying all fruits separate separately, the fruits are. So I pick eight sectors. Now what is the second priority sectors? 
it could be education okay could be it unless i have a particular okay anything else could my second priority okay now you talk about research you know i am trying to tell you how you are doing research you are just short listing here yeah, what you want given how much where will it go sir i live in punjab in india and it in those and mine out of that which will you pick see you once you go on doing that short listing how so people who got married you know, the girls who have seen how many first married you know, Oh, for five, I think I can go for that. What is it? Short listing. How many schools? How many colleges you would have just uh, in our lives? Correct, na? Huh? Finally, you see now, now this particular school. How do you do it? After selecting ten out of twenty-five, from ten make it five, from five into make it one. How many times you buy it for television? Because today life is all about spying the three parts. I love the way this big bazaars, uh, landmarks, uh, central, all the people are uh, marketing their products. All the one of the products, they ensure that you buy things that you don't want. Correct? <laughs> you go to Big Bazaar, they will ensure that you buy that you don't want. What thing is the place where you are doing billing? I mean, here is it. The place where the billing is happening, they put some four five tapas. Okay, putty putty things they put ten rupees, fifty rupees, five rupees, all the tablets. Your bill when you stood in the queue was about two fifty rupees. By that time, enter the billing of the four hundred rupees. From two to four hundred rupees. That is the marketing power of marketing technique. Sorry, technique of this uh, people. How do you go to Garuda Mall in Jaynagar? They will ensure that you go via all those places to fourth floor. By the time you go to the fourth floor, fifty percent money is gone. That's why they make you book a ticket on the internet. So that when you go there, you will have money with you to spend for something. And today in the theatre, they are they are ensured how will you spend money in the theatre. They are now supplying that big big tubs of uh, of car, and uh, this is cans of phenyl. Okay, that uh, yeah, that black okay, phenyl they give you. Huh? Okay, they give you that uh, phenyl that is more part of the ticket itself. They will ensure that the ticket you are getting today. I had a big fight once. That when you are buying ticket on the internet, you are supposed to buy that. Uh, uh, this one also. What is it? Pop. I don't want it. Pop. No, no. You have to eat, sir. Why? We are selling as we are eating. That's how they they sell all these things to us. Everything is about marketing. Marketing. How will I put? The bigger the topi I put on you, the bigger the money I make. Okay. Now shortlisting. When you shortlist, your ideas are becoming much better. Now you pick banking as your first choice. Or one of the first choices of your sectors, you know. In bank, which companies would you buy? Now, don't be in a hurry. That no oh, bank will help you. No, there are some twenty-seven banks which are on the list of banks. In that, you buy for people which are on mega cap, which are large cap, which are mid cap, which are small cap, which are. You will find. You will find all this. I have a list of everything with me. You tell me which company, which sector, I'll give you that information in two minutes. Now, what is a market capitalization? Can someone tell me what is market capitalization? Number of shares. Why do we need it? There are two types of market capitalization. What are those? There are two types of market capitalization. Which are those? One is called as full market cap. Another is called as free float market cap. What market follows is free float market. See, market cap means very simple. Another market cap is if today. A company has to be sold. The value, the number of shares available in the market, if somebody has to purchase it, at what value the company can be sold? Okay. If such multiplication gives you fifty thousand crores and above, it is called as a mega cap. All the available people in the newspapers, websites, everywhere you can. If that such multiplication. Gives you fifty thousand crores and above. They are all called as mega cap stocks. If it is below fifty thousand and above five thousand crores, they are called as large cap stocks. If it is below five thousand, above two and a half thousand, they are called as mid cap. Below two and a half thousand, above thousand crores, they are called as small cap. Below thousand crores, they are called as micro cap stocks. 
Now, RMP make it much simpler. For us to pick, now tell me if you were to start your purchase or investing journey in this market, would you buy how much of it will your portfolio have of mega cap, large cap, big, small, and micro? Assuming I'm not talking about even lakhs of rupees of investment. Let us say I am actually a, a down to earth investor and advisor. I will say I can start my investing journey with just 5,000 rupees in the market. Just 5,000 rupees you can begin your journey with the market. Because it is not about how much you are investing, no? it is about the intention to invest. That's all. Okay, just intention. That I want to. I am not even professing that you should put all your money stock money. No, you analyze your savings. This is your income. How much are you going to spend expenses? How much are you going to save? Out of your savings, split it into three parts. Make it debt, gold, equity. How much? 30, 30, 35, 30, 35, 40, 40, 20, 50, 25, 25. You decide. Who am I to decide? It's up to you. Because you are the one who wants the profit. You are the one who wants to create wealth. Once you are able to ascertain that how much of my money can I set aside, then starts how much? For example, you are putting 25% of your savings into equity market. Let's say for 5,000 rupees that you can afford to invest in the stock market. How will you begin your journey? Again, do the same exercise. To identify this will do well, you don't do the research. I don't think anybody research will say it's common sense, isn't it? To know automobile is part of consumption, banking is part of the financial system of our country, consumer durable, we all have to buy India as a story about consumption. I tell you, the one simple thing we forget in life, you know, we don't follow news. We don't follow news. We don't make news tell us. If you don't understand something, you don't ask anybody. The biggest learning comes from asking, asking, asking. If you don't get the right answer, ask somebody else. That's how I have learned in my life. I'll ask questions to myself. I'll ask questions to people. What is it? What is it? What is it? Because few years ago, government of India came out with a particular uh, law, no, not, not law, they, in the uh, five-year plan, they said that we are going to offer 100 more FM stations Effort that uh, function, we were going to sanction. Immediately, a friend of mine who was a portfolio manager, he purchased Aragon. He purchased T series. Immediately. Then why are you buying today? He, he, he gave a superb example to me that I got six, seven years ago. He said, you know, boss, the idea of this 100 effort stations coming to India, you, you cannot come today, but I am buying today. Why? You know, every song we listen, on the radio. You are enjoying listening to songs? Correct. Every song played by the FM station, FM station has to pay a royalty to the companies from where they are playing that particular song. For example, for a local regional language song, the radio has to pay 250 pesa per song per time. I repeat, if a Canada song has to be played, local language song has to be played on any radio station, that particular radio has to pay two and a half, two and a half rupees per song per time to the company which owns that particular music right. If it is a Hindi song, they pay, they pay four rupees paisa per song per time. Now Sarai Rama holds almost 70% of the song rights. So if hundreds of the world to come to the multiplication, that is why he said, I, to, I want to buy the stock today, not when the news comes out. When the other channels are going to come out, oh, it's a fool to buy then. I want to buy today. I hear this understanding of what is called as special situation. Look at the benefit that is coming. Look at the point of Saradamana, where it has touched, from where it was. We have to be receptive of the news which comes. Wait, that's why they say, buy on rumors sell on news. That is the biggest thing that you have to learn from the market. Buy on rumors, sell on news. Rumors float in the market. 
It could be good news, bad news, right news, wrong news. It's up to you to screen it. The one more segment in the market which I completely floored is that it is time to buy when you see blood downstreams. It was said by a person called Nathan Rothschild. He said it's time to buy when you see blood downstreams. 21,208 index, 10th of January 2008 to 8,000 9th of March 2009. I was there, witness, right in front of my eyes. This happened. Infosys from 2115 fell to 1215. Reliance Industries from 3,298 fell to 1,670 rupees. BHL from 2,590 fell to 1,200 rupees. State Bank of India from 2,000 rupees fell to 750 rupees. HDFC, everything fell two thirds from what it was. What do you do then? <coughs> People will go home and go zero. All stock prices will become zero. But if very few people bought SBI at 750 rupees, very few people bought Reliance at 1600 rupees, now they give a bonus. Plenty of, that is why that, that, uh, that statement said by Nathan Schwarzschild, which said, it is time to buy when you see blood downstream. What is value investing? What is bottom fishing? All these are same thing. When the markets are being battered by the day mark Nifty falls by 50 points, what are you doing? The day Sensex falls 100 points, what are you doing? Are you waiting for 100 points for tomorrow? No. Why that day? How much? Buy 500 rupees worth of index here. Just 500 rupees worth of index you buy. Today, stock market has been made so accessible. You can have 14, 15 rupees with you and buy GVK Power, which owns three airports in India. They are investing 6,500 crores, they are investing in Australian mines. Have you read that news? It has come in the last couple of weeks. The Arsenal government has cleared uh, GVK Power's uh, request. 6,500 crores are investing. It is quoting at 14 rupees. How many of us are bought it? Remain engineering, it had come to 9 rupees, it had come to few months ago. Today is 21 rupees, yeah? We are looking at index. index, index yeah. Market is falling, yeah? I ask question to people who watch the market. When you are driving your vehicle or riding your two-wheeler, we you look at the road and ride it and drive it or you look at the speed of it and ride it. Hey. Tell me properly, looking road or speedometer? Uh, if you're looking at road, then don't look at the mark, look at your investment. Index is like your speedometer. If you go to index, you will go nowhere. You look at the road intermittently, you look at your speedometer. Yeah. I'll be a fool if I look at speedometer and run my vehicle. Index is like a speedometer, you should look intermittently. That is not the end of your investment journey, correct right, no? So, before making an investment, device not to know what are buying it for? Profit is an ultimate point. There is nothing else beyond profit. That is a hidden agenda. Our open secret, what can we say about money? But what is the steps am I taking to make my investment journey a calculated risk than a risk that I am taking on my head unnecessarily? So these are the exercises of bifurcating your sectors, the sector that to do well, in that segregating your investment based on which are mega cap, which are large cap, micro cap, small cap, micro cap, then you define out of the money I have got, how much of my money I am investing in mega cap companies, how much of money I am putting in large cap, this will define your risk. If you are having more of mega and large cap, or if you are a conservative customer, conservative investor, if you are going to have more of large than mid cap, you slightly become moderate cap investor. If you are having more of mid and small cap, you become aggressive. If you are more of mid, small and micro, ultra aggressive investor. Not that you should shun, but you should not invest at all in mega cap. You should have. Now you define how much? 60% of the portfolio is in mid cap. 20% is in small and micro. 40%, another 20% is in 
may not be balanced. So I go on this, I take my, let's say, these put together, I got 60%. Mid term, I got 20%. Mid term, I got 20%. You define them. No? All these 4,060 conditions of the stock market, they all are by market based on this only. Once you are able to bifurcate, you open business standard every day, they give you including market cap. All the activity traded stocks, they give you including market cap. Don't worry about price earning, don't worry about top, no. Why am I worrying about worry about it? Because it's complicated. It is a job of a fund manager to analyze PE ratio. It's like PE ratio is one of the reasons to buy because lastly, there is something called as intrinsic value. What is intrinsic value? The real price value of the so any of you people who have been doing some research, some young people and people who have already been investors in the market, give me one example of the stock. One example of the stock which is quoting at true value. What's the Indian market is not possible. World over is not there. No, world over there is no such thing as stocks of intrinsic value are undervalued. Definitely, I I give you four of stocks are undervalued. Why? Why? Because this is about your perception. Some stocks you want to pay more. Infosys. Maybe it has never traded, except for that uh, 2008 debacle. It has never traded under its intrinsic value. Because you comment with what is in the portfolio. Nothing can happen. It's like having 10 to You may not score run, and the opposite will feel scared if you do the That is the idea. It's like a portrait. That was the top. Put on the wall, the wall will look good. Take out the pretty wall will look good. That is the idea of So, if we have to create a portfolio, you need to define how should that portfolio look. It's not about the DMAT account which stays from A to Z. Because the DMAT account is designed to give you alphabetical order. It can't give you a portfolio. You can make a portfolio. Your stock portfolio can make a portfolio. Then, with this, Intrinsic value, nothing is intrinsic value, there is nothing part. There is textbook tells you the price of a stock at this earning should be this. If it is not available, what should you do? Because we don't want to pay more for a stock. Because market perceive who is market? We only. Who made this market? We only. So a number of people feel that this is the price that we are willing to pay and poor value. Stock. The sentiments are weak. The same song is available to you at an undervalued price. This goes on. 100 years from today, this goes on. It is not going to change. This is going to stay for a long, long, long time to come because this is what works in the market. So, the simple thing in the market for us to, I am not saying to make money. Yes, we all want to make money. We all will indeed make money in the market. There will be operations like MCX, sorry, like SCX Microfinance, Reliance Power, Satyam Computer, we will have operations. Absolutely, Amitabh Bachchan has made in many of the movies. Charo Khan has made many of his movies. Okay, does, does it mean that Amitabh Bachchan is a bad actor? Everything has its time. Every, everything has its volatility. There is nothing called as perfection to be Suraj mein aage, chand mein There is nothing perfection. I have to seek perfection, that's why it's a continuous endeavor. I go on trying, 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 trying. That's objective. Do not deviate from this objective. Define the return that you want. After that, what happens? Don't care about it. Once you deviate from it, don't blame the market. Okay, now questions.